Welcome to Yosemite Valley. You think the guy who wrote that down actually cared if he felt welcome when he showed up here? Yeah, well, it was probably old man William after all. Good old granddad. So I guess I should probably feel welcome. You know, he had a much bigger heart than me. I haven't been here since I was just a little lad. Other than that one night. Oh, gee, what? I guess I'll have to walk from now on. I can finally just take a true breath of air and breathe in that cold, fresh mountain air full of possibilities and hope. You know, I could really start over here. Start a new life. A new life? I'm not really sure if I deserve it. But I'm told that I should forgive myself. At least all the pain inside. I can look for answers. Might not be the ones I'm hoping for, but they might be the ones that help me all the same. Grandpa used to carry me around pert near. I'd always get tired and complain about having to walk up the hills and walk down the hills and how the old timers always say, you know, they walk to school uphill both ways in the snow and the rain. They never had good stories, but I really felt that way when I was younger. You know, but Grandpa, he was a strong man. He'd throw me right on his back and carry me right over the mountain if I asked him to. But changed my life for better living off the land like the old man did. I want to get back to that. I'm looking for a more truer, simpler way of living. It's crazy what they did back then with their bare hands, living off the land, making stuff that would last a lifetime. This cabin looks a little rusty, a little bit worse for wear, but all intents and purposes, it's still livable. And it still looks pretty good inside, so I guess the old man did a good job when he built this place. So go ahead and ask yourself, will Theodore be able to fill those footsteps his grandfather left empty? Will he find the answers that he's looking for? Will you be able to unravel his past? Do you have what it takes to become the next Yosemite Forest Ranger?